All right, so now we're ready to apply a color. Uh, the customer wants red. Uh, so we're going to do a red fade about halfway up. And remember, we're going to use the blow dryer while we apply the color. Uh, the one thing with this rayon material is that, unlike t-shirts, you don't really have to worry about too much of the overspray if you did a really good job with initially laying down your verbiage. Uh, try not to worry about any other overspray coming off. It actually gives it a little glow, so it's not so bad. Um, so we're going to lightly go into it. Remember, don't point the blow dryer towards your uh, artwork for too long, or the surface for too long, because it will melt it. With color, you may have to go back over it once or twice to give it a really deep, true color. But that's okay. Remember, keep your blow dryer on your surface, but always move it within two to three seconds, kind of like I'm doing. Also, depending on what red you use, whether it's an opaque or transparent, you are able to cover up your blemishes. So, a few of the mistakes that you may have, uh, you should be able to cover them up if, uh, while you're applying color. And as you just saw, using the blow dryer, I had to clean off the tip of my needle. You're probably going to do that more so while using the blow dryer because the paint is drying faster. But that's okay. See how I'm holding? I've been doing it for so long, I'm able to kind of airbrush with one hand and dry with the other. Whatever works for you guys, there's no particular method. When I first started out, I kind of had both my hands together because I wanted to make sure that it was drying the rayon surface while I was working. Okay, so as I'm going, I'm looking for consistency, especially dealing with the red. If you lightly dust an area and you don't give it a true consistency, it's going to look pink on you, and that's the last thing you want. Also, you don't want to build up too much on the round, because I'm going to apply a light clear coat to it. The last thing you want is for the paint to appear to chip off the rayon. So light passes until you achieve the color that you want. And then later you can take a can clear and just lightly clear it. I would suggest a matte finish. And... Uh, the customer can use this tent for years to come. I'm Greg Edwards with Greg's Airbrushing. Take it easy.